Jaspreet Bumrah won the man of the series in the World Cup by showing his skills and abilities to perform under pressure. But how did he develop these abilities that make him one of the best fast bowlers? There is a lot to learn from Bumrah even if you are not pursuing a career in sports. Can anyone achieve this kind of success? Absolutely. Stay tuned till the end of the video where you will learn how to develop these skills effectively. Imagine if engineering colleges in India introduce a new course, B.Tech in sports with a specialization in cricket bowling. In this course, you will learn projectile motion equations and calculate the path of a thrown ball. Using cosine and sine functions, you will figure out the best angles for releasing the ball. And going deeper into maths, you will study solid and differential geometry to understand the shape and structure of cricket balls. Apart from this, you will also have lectures and factory visits on ball manufacturing guided by Kukabura, Dukes and SG experts. Additionally, you also have biology classes where you study the structure and function of muscles, bones, joints, tendons and ligaments involved in bowling. These are just theory classes. Every week you will have 2-3 to three hours of lab sessions too. Where you need to calculate the surface friction of the given ball, find the speed, trajectory of the thrown ball etc. After mastering the material, you will have your selection trials. Mm semester exams, where you need to answer 1 mark multiple choice questions, 2 mark short questions and 16 mark long questions. Ok ok I get it, we might be going a little too far but you see where this is headed right? Obviously these classes won't make you anywhere nearly as skilled as Bumrah. Don't get us wrong, we agree, understanding the science and biomechanics of bowling is valuable and supportive. However, knowing these alone doesn't produce a good bowler. Jaspreet Bumrah has reached the pinnacle of his craft by going out there in the field, practicing relentlessly and being there in crunch match situations. The same thing applies for engineers too. Just like in cricket, becoming a top software engineer isn't about acing exams. While understanding theory and principles is crucial, you can only turn pro when you tackle real world problems. You can do this by working on projects, internships, post contributions and more. So, get out there. Take on challenges, keep pushing your boundaries, that is how you will achieve greatness too.